that's part of the, I think, the narrative here that there's this big anti-vaccination movement going on and that, I mean, even Alan was saying, well, this turns into, what is it going to turn into? If, if people believe that it's important for their child to be vaccinated, get your child vaccinated. This boils down to a very simple issue, parental rights. Parental rights. Do you have the right to control what your child does or doesn't ingest? What they eat, what they what they drink, what they wear. You want the government to mandate how many hours of sleep your child gets? Listen, if you're abusing your child, you need to face the consequences. But to say that you have to obey the government, what's happening in California and what's happening now, the real movement, I think, is the pushback against the the small percentage of parents who have a personal conviction, such as a fear that vaccinations are linked to autism. I, I always think it's fascinating that people are so definitive in saying, well, the science says that's not the case. Listen, we don't know. We're not scientists. It's a little bit like the global warming debate. Are we grow, we know the scientists. I'm going to accept Alan's challenge and put two debate two experts on to debate this. And you can decide as, as you hear it. But for every scientist who says that man is creating the end of the planet, and you know, and we're going to all be underwater, and we're, we're there's this this horrific global warming problem. There's another scientist who says no. There's no. There's not. No. There's not. 